Danny, you did it! I'm proud of you. The Tigre would have been too. We have destroyed the only place on this island where they produce the poison they spray on the tobacco fields in the west. After they use up the poison... No more wonder drug. Danny, you're not going to believe it, but before we hit McKay at the port, I got a special request from Clara. And she's got a point. Didn't see that coming. We have an opportunity to do something bigger. If we destroy Castillo's oil reserves in El Este right now, it will choke his army of fuel across the island. I like the sound of that. Go hit the big red tanks all over La Jolla. Our guerrillas will help you. I sent them pics of what to target. Gracias, comadre. In the clear. I copy! One of Castillo's speeches? No, I'm serious. My great-grandparents had a brutal life. They left one country to go to another and made something of themselves. They passed that wealth on to the next generation. My parents. They built on it. They gave it to me. So you want me to move? <sighs> well, that would solve my immediate problems, but no, no. You can stay in Yara, but Castillo wants a change here. He does. I talk to him every day. He wants it as fast as you do. Sometimes it is better to swim with the current than to go against it. So I should just accept the arrests, the outcast system, the executions? Every modern country in the history of the world has dark days. Only difference now is that everybody can film it and stream it and try to get the world pissed off about it. Even in my country, Canada, go hook up what they did to the indigenous folks and the fracking Jesus Murphy. But hey, nobody is perfect. Talk all you want. You are nothing but a fucking invader. Ah, keep trying to be a badass. See where that gets you a couple generations from now. Think about what I said. We're heating the silos at the refinery. You coming? I got you. for what he did to us. And end Castillo's rule over El Este. Hola. McKay, you at the port? As a matter of fact, I am. Sitting in my little fortified panic room. It's Russian made and impossible to open. But I'll just wait for Castillo's reinforcements. Great. I'll swing by and say hello. I won't. 
That hijo de puta's mine. Guys, 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 guys. The momentum is shifting. If you don't make a stand against the guerrillas here, you're gonna lose. Now go out there and fight for Castillo. McKay wasn't there. The office was a fucking trap. Cuño, that intel came from a fucking traitor. If I know anything about foreign traitors, they have one idea in their head if they're losing. McKay has to be on one of those ships. Yankee was on that ship, he's a dead man. He wasn't. McKay's on the one farther out. You sure this time? This intel comes from one of Gilberto's people. She's on that ship and has a visual on him. On my way. Gilberto will get on the line.
little chameleon on the ship sabotaged the engine. She says there's a hole and some smoke coming from the hole. You can't miss it. You and your chameleons are fucking amazing. I know, but don't tell them that. Or else I may have to pay them more. Ha! <laughs> I'll keep an eye out and shoot my way in. Good luck, honey. Weapons here. I think the other ship had more. I'm McKay. Don't see him. We'll look up top. Backpacks here. Danny, the situation has changed. Don't want to hear it right now, Juan. See, si, see, si, he's a skin tag on a weasel's asshole. Well. But we just made a deal. McKay is offering us a fuck ton of cash if we let him go. We're talking real dinero, Danny. No way Clara's good with this. I'll deal with Clara. You and I both know the real war starts the first minute Castillo dies. And you can't win that fight without cash. Trust me. We've been doing pretty good with bullets. Leave him alone and head back to the port. I'm on my way there now. It's time to celebrate. We won! <laughs> go on, backpack. Go, go. Join the fiesta back on the mainland. I'm sure they're gonna have a piñata set up and everything for you. I'm thinking. Ah! Uh, you fucked yourself, backpack! Uh, uh. Adios, McKay. El este para siempre, Danny. Y Elena. I only wish Horon could have seen you put that fucker in the ground. Fuck McKay's money. Let's hear it for Danny. You should say something. I've given enough speeches. Then I think it's only appropriate You've that I say You've had your time, so. Lorenzo. Huh? Lucky. <laughs> Today, for the first time in my life, I actually feel lucky. When I look into the eyes of your generation, I see the same Fire, the same passion, the same hope I used to see in mine. Together, we have the chance to create something new. It's your turn. Let's make this Yara's last war. La Moral, Legends of 67. Bienvenidos al este, Clara. Welcome to Libertad. Gracias, but no. La Moral's good on its own. 
Is that right? We'll help you kill Castillo, but we'll also keep an eye on Libertad. You want me to trust this wrinkled up abuelo to fix Ariada? No. We fight. We don't follow. I like this one. That's two of us. Si una esperanza. <laughs> <laughs> I know there are many who speak of the old revolution of 67 like a dream. That these murderers were heroes? They will destroy your future, just as they did my father's. When I look into your eyes, I see lions. Libertad. La moral. Murderers of 67. These are lies. The truth? They are all known by the same name. Terrorista! I have a vision. To rebuild paradise. But these terroristas have made sure the cost of paradise will be blood. Let this be Yara's last revolution. Let us claim victory to the lions! Coño. Wish you two were here. Where's this party at? Batter off. Danny, head for Valle de Oro to help Massimus Matanzas. Now that McKay is out of the picture, we have ample where we want him. You sound confident. We have to be. We have to beat Castillo. The prize for second place is a bullet. We're going to win. Viva Libertad, Clara. Viva Libertad, Danny.